All right, let's try out Fireball EU PvP Realm. Vanilla. See how this goes. Here we go then. Finally, you are of age adventurer, of age to battle in the name of the Horde, to conquer for the glory of the War Chief. Yes, you will do nicely. No doubt you wish to find a great dragon or demon and strangle it with your bare hands. But perhaps it would be wise to start on something less dangerous. Report to Garnek. He should be able to assign a task better suited to a young adventurer. You will find Gornek in the den to the west. I wonder where the interface was for a second then. Those warlocks who came before us have earned the distrust of the Horde. And while we are tolerated, we are not loved. This has not brought the warlocks closer together, however, as many choose to live reclusively, dabbling in their magics alone. I will not seek to lead you down one path or the other but only help you in your maturation. Before I teach you the art of summoning, bring me six heads of the vile familiars from the cave to the northeast. Another one of Kaltunk's recruits, hmm? A sorry state of affairs we find ourselves in, if this is the best the Horde can produce. Very no nice. By the time we think you're ready to leave the valley, you'll be a proud adventurer of the Horde. Yes. The first order of business will be to put a little strength in your backbone. I could send you out to the barons to hunt Kodo, but well, in all honesty, you're more useful to us alive than dead. I believe you would find a good match with the mottled boars you'll find to the north of here. A good match to a bar. Then again, I suppose a bar did kill Robert Baratheon, so... It could kill a level 1 orc. He was drunk, mind. Right, let's test and see how many people are kicking about. 50 in that bracket. Over 50 in that one. I honestly can't believe how busy this server is. I didn't think EU vanilla servers were doing that well. But obviously they are. To have that many people on in each bracket as well when Cat has just been released. Good going. I think there'll be a resurgence again of these servers pretty soon. One, the fact that there's people trying to do it on the American servers and I just think some people will play a cat for a bit, get bored some people get bored of Season of Discovery and they'll end up back over here back home it does have a good vibe to it, Vanilla just chilling on the night, doing a bit of levelling Need that at some point, but obviously not yet. I always make undead warlocks, but 
I've been making a lot of undeads recently with different playthroughs, so needs to be arc. Can't just keep doing the same zone again and again. Well, I could. Oh, and that quest getting read out, that was an add-on. So all the quests will be getting read out to us on this playthrough. Won't be able to do that one, yeah, but... Might as well go and pick it up. Adventurer. I thought I would die out here with none to know of it. While I was hunting the scorpids of the valley, I came across a particularly vicious looking one. Hurling myself at it, I managed to inflict a massive blow to its claw before it closed around my leg. I wasn't ready for its stinger though, and it sliced down and into my chest, cutting into my flesh and letting my blood. Please, you must kill the scorpid for me. My honor must be upheld. I fought it up on the plateau to the south. I'm not sure whether you can hear it that well. Turn those up. Just to make sure that people can hear the dialogue of the quests. Just did that again. I'll check the bulletin board in a moment, that's a good one to check to test how busy things are. Scott out, need tank, other black rock, to speed running across the gear of world boss. Next year, it's not really the best time to be looking though, 9, 9.35. What day is it today? Wednesday. Don't know why I'm going for this, I don't need it. Four of these ones. Was a fun class to level Warlock, just so many abilities once you get going. And interesting ones. Compared to Mage, I've never really liked Mage. Even though once upon a time it was my main, but that was only because that was when I first died the game. So I didn't know any better. Whereas now it's just a class that suits me the absolute least. First is DK Pally. Big mealy boys. If that healing reduces healing effects on you, oh, it's useless then. Oh, they got it. Come 
I'm getting down. Last one here. feel like it's as bright orange as normal. I wonder if that's because it's at night. Normally, the, I always thought that the orangeness of the sand and everything just felt overpowering. It's too bright. Doesn't actually feel as bad today. I think it's because the server time is 1036. I don't normally start a character at this time. See why I wouldn't normally be on the computer at this time, but seeing as I'm off work tomorrow, doesn't really matter, does it? Don't have to be anywhere till half ten in the morning. That background music. Nice to see someone leveling. And another one. Keep those for now. I normally sell all my food and water, but on vanilla you'll actually need it. Not Throughout cow. your training Ooh, as a yes. warlock, you will learn to call forth beings of many sorts. Some may not seem it, but all are useful tools. Do not be fooled by the imp's small size. As you no doubt noticed, it is still a formidable adversary. Zuritha has been sending novices like yourself to help cull the numbers of the creatures in the cave, near where you fought the vile familiars. I think it would be good for you to gain experience by assisting her. Be sure to tell her that you assisted with the imp problem. She'll probably have a reward for you. Hmm, not bad, adventurer. But don't let it get to your head. You'll fight tougher than boars in your career. Nonetheless, you've proven yourself well, and your next trial will be against a considerably more dangerous opponent. So you'll need some extra protection. Ah, uh, while you were gone, a parchment came for you, adventurer. I usually avoid dealing with warlocks if I can help it, but I think you should read it when you have time. If I'm not mistaken, it came from your newly appointed trainer, Nartok. He would have words with you when you're ready. Powerful warrior and awkward novice alike have fallen to the venomous sting of the Scorpid. You will find large numbers of Scorpids northwest of here. Bring me eight of their tales as proof of your prowess in battle. The antidote for their sting is actually made from venom extracted from their stingers. We keep large quantities of antidote for scorpid venom on hand to heal young bloods just like you. Young blood. But I'm sure you won't be needing any of that, will you? You have done well, adventurer. Although the vile familiars were merely pets of the darker powers within the burning blade, your success against them foretells greater deeds ahead. Through my divinations, I see that an item of power hides deep within the Burning Blade Coven, guarded by beasts and black magic. It is called the Burning Blade Medallion, and your next task is to find it and remove it from the coven. But be wary, for the medallion may be possessed by an agent of the Burning Blade. And if so, then the agent's power would be greater than the familiars you have already encountered. Go, adventurer. I will. You will find the coven in a cave to the north and west. And now you've joined our ranks also. Don't misunderstand, adventurer. Just because you have access to power that many will be jealous of, it does not mean you will be accepted easily. Thrall allows our kind into Orgrimmar, because we are still his fellow kin. He cannot turn his back on us, or we would become as pathetic as the humans who enslaved him. My point is, be careful. You can be powerful, but if you are foolish, then you are as yes, good this. dead. If you need training in spells, then return to me. It sure gets hot out here in the Valley of Trials. If only I had some cactus apples, I could make my famous cactus apple surprise. <laughs> Nothing cools you off faster than a piece of that delicious treat. I'll tell you what, adventurer. 
If you bring me 10 cactus apples, I'll make you a few portions of cactus apple surprise to take with you on your adventures. If you're interested, you can find cactus apples growing near the cactus plants around here. Makes Cursed sense. peons. They work hard gathering lumber from the trees of the valley, but they're always taking naps. I need someone to help keep the peons in line. You look like the right person for my task. Here, you take this blackjack and use it on any lazy peons you find sleeping on the job. A good smack will get them right back to work. I bet it will. Return the blackjack when you're done. Lousy smacking peons. Smacking someone with that. It's quite interesting to hear all the quests. Because half the time you just go to someone, accept, click accept, and then you just go and kill five people or collect ten items. have no idea why, you just do it. So we might actually hear some interesting stories as we're leveling up. The only thing that I'm not looking forward to with this server is it being PvP. Oh, but don't just get ganked constantly once I get to 20s and 30s. I actually prefer leveling on PvE servers, but none of them are, have got a decent population. I don't know whether it's worth putting it in melee or not, or do you just spam this? I think the difference will be seconds anyway. Maybe literally a second or two. Let's see. Twenty-five mana, twenty-five mana. Go hand that in to that guy down there. Bag's nearly full already. Hopefully we get a little pouch. That would be ideal. Makes a massive difference at these lower levels. See if you're going back and forth to vendors, because I'm going to have to do that in a minute. What professions do I go on this then? Go enchanting. And I'll end up going sort of like herb elk just to give myself portions but my blow was not enough to kill him but looking at the damage I inflicted gives me some small measure of pride that small measure will be all I have to sustain myself if I die and in that light a short list of my life's accomplishments seeing the deed you have done for me steals my heart I cannot fall so easily I must endure. Yes. But it remains that I cannot make the trek back to the den unassisted. Please, adventurer, return to the den and tell Gormak of my situation. Perhaps he can help me. I don't know why I just don't carry him back. You would think that would be your first follower mission, wouldn't you? Carrying him back to the base. Looking at the size of my guy's arms, you'd think he'd be able to. He's a big lad. He 
Yeah, bags full. I'll do this though. I suppose I can do the weight the peons so that doesn't actually require me to pick anything up. Sure, health like where is it? Like that, but I'm leaving it off for now. I think it just sort of adds to the sort of better look. What? I can do that. Having less stuff on the screen. I didn't even think about that actually making a shaman. I quite like those. Maybe do that later on at some point. Okay. I actually think their living is quite faster. People normally more like slow, but I don't think so. Especially the first few levels. Quite like enhanced. Love the ambiance music for the early zone. It just reminds me of being a kid. Going around my mum's house want? just so I could play on a computer upstairs for hours and hours. No troubles. No bills. Well, I suppose there was always troubles no matter what age you are, but just different ones, aren't there? You are a dependable person. Oh, no. Can I count on you for another task? Yeah. Some time ago, I was surveying the cave to the north for minerals, and I left my favorite pick behind. Oh, you When I later returned to retrieve it, I found the cave was filled with vicious beasts. Oof. Will you go into the cave, the burning blade coven, and get my pick? I left it in a chamber with waterfalls. My pick has a spell on it, so you can see it in the dark, so you won't have to worry about finding it. Just what's guarding it? Wonderful adventurer. As promised, here is your cactus apple surprise, plus a little cactus something extra. Surprise. Don't know why that makes me chuckle. The Valley of Trials will temper even the weakest into a warrior worthy to join the horde. Those who cannot rise to its test will be left to bake in the scorching desert sun. There is an important lesson that you must take away from fighting scorpids. The smallest or largest of opponents can still send you to your doom in fierce combat. Any number of things can prove your downfall. I have no more to teach you, adventurer. You have done well, and I will watch your progress with interest. No, I won't From either, your yeah. description of the beast, I believe you must be speaking of Sarkov. It is no wonder that Hanazua was overtaken by it. Aid will be dispatched to him immediately. Trouble yourself no more with Hanazua's plight. However, I must say, I am most impressed to hear that you brought Sarkov to death. It is a feat to be proud of, adventurer, and that you would fight for a stranger's honor while other tasks occupied your time. Your own honor is heightened. I'm amazed that someone's made that add-on and voiced every single quest free of charge. Fair play to him. I still can't get over the year this came out. The fact this came out in 2004 is just unbelievable. When you look at other games that came out around that time and how good this game looks still. I 
at the vastness of the world for the that era. Unbelievable. This might actually be quite tricky again in there. Corrosion must do a lot of damage. What we need is a wand. That makes a massive difference for casters in vanilla. The quicker the better as well. Or it feels that way to me. It feels like you're doing more when you're constantly up to something. Straightforward and do I go all the way around or straight forward then left? I can't remember. Is he a pet though? My minion? Yeah, Deathix minion. It's not exactly like having a pet lion, is it? Or cat. Like hunters have. Obviously, I was not in real life. You don't tend to have pet lions unless you're one of those nutters. You see, like Dubai. That's never going to end well when you see pictures or videos of that. I've never owned a pet where, if it had got in a bad mood, it could kill me within seconds. I think, do I go around the top? I think that's there. Looking for a group to clear Skull Rock. Skull Rock, I recognise that name. Is that where I am now? No, it can't be. Why would you be doing that at level 11? Is it just near Ogremar in there? Yeah, it will be, won't it? If that's level 12. And we have to keep on the pet attack. I just have to keep on to the one of my mouse buttons on the side. Do that at some point. Just check this if this video is ready. Visibility public.
Just releasing a player through. A rogue one for Kata. And obviously I'm doing a couple for vanilla as well now, it seems. Let's try it with the old Imola on. I think that felt quicker. Thought I'd have aggroed him from there. Unless it gives you a little bit of leeway in these lower levels, perhaps. This could be dangerous. Goblos. I'm sure you get mana back from just sitting down. You don't get health, but I'm sure you get it from just sitting. That's why I've got that macro. Might not be true, but pretty sure I've heard that before. And what harm does it do either way? There we go, nice one. I think that's all the starter quests done. my face if I'd have done that and her stunned when <laughs> I had to do that again let's face it we've all done stuff like that before go this one there's a couple of people knocking about the fact that there's just what three and one there plus me five Speak, friend. at this time of night Wait, you got it Thanks a lot, adventurer. This is my favorite pick. Now, if my peons ever finish chopping down these trees, maybe we can find a nice cave to mine. Speak, friend. Look, friend. You retreat. Well done. Your efforts within the burning blade have been our key in rooting out this cult right, in the valley. Let's defend some of this stuff. But I fear they have further aims in our land. We have not seen the end of them. That feels quicker than how I did the undead bit. Blade are finished here in the valley, but I want you to report your findings. Go to the troll village of Senjin and seek out Master Gadrin. Senjin village is east out of the valley, then right at the fork. Tell Gad. Right, I'll leave that there for the first part of the playthrough. So we've done the first zone in half an hour. So on to the next little village in part two.